Hi everyone, in today's video we will learn how to clone ourselves in a video using Filmora. So let's do it. To create the clone effect in Filmora, I shot two different videos of myself. For the first video, I stood on this side of the frame while keeping this side empty. While for the second video, I stood here on this side of the frame while keeping this side of the frame empty. Remember, you have to shoot both the videos at exactly the same place. What I mean here is, your background should be same for both the videos. You cannot have anything moving in your background. Everything has to be stationary. And thirdly, your camera should be placed at exactly the same location for shooting both the videos. These are pre-requirements for creating a clone effect. Now, when we are done with the shooting part, let's get to the editing part. So, I have imported both of my clips into Filmora and I will be aligning them onto the timeline one by one. I will firstly choose this clip where I am standing on the left and I will drag and drop it onto the timeline. Then I will choose the second clip where I am standing on the right and I will drag and drop it onto the timeline and I will place it a video above my first video. Now, if we preview this video, we will only be able to see the video which is on the upper layer because it has completely covered the video below. So what I'm going to do is, I will double click on this video on the upper layer. I will go to the mask option and here I will choose the parallel line mask. Now I will drag this parallel line mask towards the right hand side. And I will also increase its size by dragging it from points like this. This way we will be able to see both of our videos in the frame. But because of the insertion of this mask, a harsh line separating these two videos has appeared which looks quite odd. So we will get rid of this line by scrolling down on the mask menu. And here we will find the blur strength option. We will increase the value of blur strength to some extent. And because of that we will get rid of this line separating our two videos. Let's click on OK and our final video is ready. Let's see how this looks. So this is how you can easily clone yourself in a video using Filmora. I hope you find this video useful. If yes, please give it a like, share your views in the comment section and please subscribe to the channel Cinematic Edits. Thank you so much.